Alright everybody, so uh, I'm back with the first kind of actual video here in the Crescent Hotel. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say my kind of experience with my first night in here. And then I'll ask the other two people that are staying with me. So let's just get right into that. So my first night in here wasn't that, uh, that spooky, I guess you could say. We didn't really do any ghost hunting we kind of just crashed in the beds pretty much i couldn't sleep that well but that's just a problem i've been having that's uh nothing to do with that's nothing to do with spooky ghost stuff but i, I may change for the others in this room so let's go ask them okay so now that we've done our first night here would you say that there was anything paranormal or weird that happened that first night uh, no, nothing paranormal, weird. Waking up at two, that's normal for me. <laughs> uh, no, nothing weird or paranormal, no odd feelings or anything like that. Uh, there's a lot of noise, but I think a lot of people were still walking around. Like us going up at two in the morning and walking around the hotel for a couple of floors. Yeah. People probably heard that and thought it was paranormal, but it was just us. So, was there anything weird or paranormal that happened your first night here? Nothing weird or paranormal. I slept pretty good, except for you guys getting up at two. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> and um, I'm looking forward to the ghost tour tonight, though. And I bought a book on the history, so I'm hoping that gives us a better idea of where the ghosts might be. Flip the camera for you guys. No one over here. Can't get under the bed because there's a board there. But no one in here. Just me. And I've genuinely just heard like a whisper, an actual whisper of someone say, uh, get out of here. <laughs> Which I was like, because there's people talking out there, but you can't whisper. And, and I would have heard that in here. That's, that's not how that would have worked. I'm, it freaked me out a little bit. I got up and I looked around. I'm like, Is someone in here with me? There's no one in here, so... Okay, so I'm gonna grab my K2 here and... And ask if there's anything in here. I just heard you say get out of here, and if you really want me to get out, then could you please just get close to this thing I have in my hand? A shiver, but that's that's normal. There's that over there. Got to think rationally about this stuff, guys. Not everything you hear is a ghost, and which is why I'm saying what I heard maybe could have been the people that are out there doing their thing. But at the same time, it was a flat-out whisper, and I don't think. They could have made a noise that sounded like a whisper and said that just to prank me, but it could have been. Definitely could have been. Here, I'll walk around. I'll walk around and see if I can get a reading, but more than likely, I won't get a reading. Whoa. Went off a little bit. I'm trying to get it in frame still, but not as much. It will stick in the closet. That's like the staple place for ghosts to be. Why are they lying to me? There was no reading in there. Alright, seems like we've got absolutely nothing. So, turn that off. And uh, I'll 
update you guys on this if anything else happens or if I hear anything.